It's been a busy build up to Christmas for all at Gloucestershire CCC. In between training, the boys have been getting into the Christmas spirit and helping out Gloucestershire's newest member of staff on his quest to run 52 half marathons in 52 weeks to raise funds for the hospital that saved his baby daughter's life. Bob Smith, who recently joined the coaching staff as the strength and conditioning coach, will cover almost 700 miles in his challenge, all in aid of the Grand Appeal, the Bristol Children's Hospital charity. Yeah, it's going very well, actually. I'm trying to give the boys a workout, so I don't know. I'll probably fade quite a bit in the last 10. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But no, it's going really well. It's a beautiful day and nice, nice scenery down by the waterside. So yeah, really great cause. Yeah, I mean, this place has just been amazing to us. And we've, um, you know, my wife and I are just tremendously grateful for everything they've done. So, you know, we're just, um, just, just getting as much money together as we can and having some fun along the way as well. He's been running 52 half marathons in 52 weeks. I think this was his 49th. So the boys thought our last day before Christmas we'd go and help him out. But Benny, for you, you're, <laughs> you're tiring a bit there. It was an interesting decision to decide to run. No, it's a good cause, but uh, it was tough and he's pretty fit, is our Bob. They were also on hand to help put a smile or two on some special little people's faces who will be in hospital over Christmas. With the help of some very generous donations from our friends at Totally Toys and Finders Keepers, the guys dropped off some presents at the children's hospital. That's not really um, hard to come in here when, when you've got the kids in here who can't be home over Christmas. And it's a great touch from the boys that you can see behind uh, coming in, donate their time as well. Uh, to, to hand out some presents to the kids who uh, are not going to be at home on Christmas. So from our point of view, uh, very easy to be in here today and, and to help out and to show any little bit of appreciation we can towards the kids who, as I said, aren't going to have uh, Christmas at home. And on that note, we'd like to wish you all a very Merry Christmas from everyone at Gloucestershire CCC. And don't forget, if you want to keep up to date with what's happening at the club, make sure you keep checking all our social media platforms and don't miss a thing.